And even if the federal government they don't samaya and they say they don't call a bit technical bid from 17 civil society organizations to take monitor the recently repatriated $311 million Abacha loot away they call a bid from the United States of America. The head of the Asset and Recovery Unit of the Ministry of Justice, Ladidi Mohammed, in Samayana say the civil society organization and then good day certified once then vet them from the ministry. And still Yana say the CSO supposed some independent assessment for the implementation of projects and within they expect to be funded with and for the recovered loot. And according to her project, and where they expected to be funded from the recovered cash, now the Lagos Ibano Expressway, Abuja Kanu Expressway, and the second Ninja Bridge. As most of you are aware, last month this money was repatriated to Nigeria from the United States of America. And part of the agreement, the tripartite agreement much. between the three countries, that is the Bawik of the island of Jersey, the United States of America, and Nigeria, is that there will be civil society organization involvement in the implementation of the expenditure. That means the projects that are going to be the funds where these projects will be put in will also be monitored by civil society organizations. They will monitor how this money is expended, whether or not it is put into those projects. Uh, you know there is an agreement between the federal government and uh, the three, two other countries. And as part of the agreement, I think uh, leaders were uh, advised by the federal government Considered to have met the minimum requirement, are invited to submit financial. 